I've got a good feeling about this one. A love heart! It's so cute! Let's see who spins the wheel. I'm great at thumb wars. Yes! I won! Oh, so close. Please don't be bad. No paper. But how am I supposed to draw? Guess you'll need to figure that out. Watch this. I'll start by drawing a line down the middle. And another one. Then some lines at the top and bottom. And now for the sides of the heart. The pencil makes great guidelines for when we start to use ink. Once the basic shape is done, use an eraser to remove the guidelines around the edges. Then grab a pen and just follow the lines. It creates a great 3D effect. Now to add the color, remember to stay inside the lines. Once that's done, add shadowing to the inside edges. A regular pencil is fine for this. Just add to anywhere you think there would be a shadow, or where you think the light would be different. It's a different way of drawing a love heart, but it looks so impressive. That's it! What do you think? Wow! I mean, it's okay. What can I use? I know! My hands! It's pretty basic. There must be something I can do. Got it! A tiny heart! Huh? How about this? It's a heart! No, it isn't. Sorry. Okay, now what do you think? Ugh, just give up! I know I can do this! Come on, fingers, don't let me down! I think I figured it out! I just need a red pen. Place one finger on top of the other, then draw a love heart. Then simply use a red pen to fill it in. It's not too bad. I like it. Or should I say, I love it. But I'm not finished. Let's add a smiley face. And you need another one for true love. How romantic! Look! Seriously? Aw, that's so cute! Hold on! I have an idea too! Don't ruin it! It'll be great! There! They're hugging! I think I'm gonna cry! It's so sweet! The morning of exam day! Hold it! You have the answers in there? Ugh, how does he always know? Mm. Goodbye, sweet answers. You should have known better. Have fun! These kids never learn. Good morning! My book? Not gonna find much in there. Very good, Lily. Move along. I really needed those answers! So far so good! Looks like Teach didn't look close enough, cause my cheat sheet made it through! Hey! Why didn't I think of that? My ruler's of no help! Lily! Psst! Can I see that? Shh! Just lift the top open, see? For this, you'll need two rulers. Take your answers and stick on some double-sided tape. Peel off the back so that it can stick to the rulers. Make sure its middle matches the middle of the rulers. That way you can fold it like this. Thanks! I'm done, sir! Can I spin the wheel? No, it's my turn. Aww. Go on. Settle it with a thumb more? Let's go. This could take a while. Stop! Why don't we both spin it? Good idea! Oh! Sup? This is gonna be epic! Wait, where are we? Maybe we should go. Wow! My first tattoo! Whoa! You're eager! Let's do this! Are you crazy? This is gonna look sick! <laughs> it tickles! 
Wow! Look at that! That's some of my best work. Uh, that's different. I love it! Keep that away from me! Mommy, save me! Your turn, bro. No way! I'll just use this printout instead. I'll cut the butterfly out of the paper. Then I'll put it face down on my wrist. I need some aftershave to wet it. Now I'll press it against my skin. A pain-free tattoo. It suits me, wow! Ah, uh, no. I feel so pretty! Excited to be here. I wonder what we'll have to do. Mmm, I didn't know the tea in this place would be so delicious. Look at that over there! Oh, wow, look at how beautiful they all are. So much color. I've never seen anything like it before. Indeed. Look at how they move in the wind. So beautiful. I absolutely love them and their beauty. Hmm, this tea has gone off, I think. Hmm, gonna be sick. Oh, man, come on! We are being so complimentary of them. Oh, my goodness, isn't that unfortunate? Why are you laughing at me? You got pooped on, too. Huh? What are you talking about? Oh my… Uh, see, I've drank out of this cup. Oh my goodness, <laughs> this is actually quite funny. Why are you laughing? There were two poops! Wait a second. <laughs> that gives me a good idea. Oh, uh, this white canvas will not work. There we go. This is much better, I think. Okay, I need some chalk. And then I'll draw the number two. Since that was my inspiration. And then I'll need to draw a second two. <laughs> two twos. Then I'll build up from there. Have to make some waves around here. And a straight stick. Gotta put some feathers over here. This will be the wing. Can't forget to draw a cute little eye. And of course, it can't be a bird without a beak. Time for a fun little chalk trick. Blending. Ew, this is so gross. Why did this happen to me? And I'm done with my picture. Ahem, take a look at my artwork. I believe I did an excellent job capturing the parrots. Oh my goodness, I love it. Huh? No! You've got to be kidding me! It's my turn to spin the wheel. Wait, what? Okay, fine. Make sure you do it right. A dog! This shouldn't be too hard. Am I supposed to be intimidated? I've got this. Okay, a dog. Where do I start? It helps I'm an animal lover. I'll start by drawing a circle. What now? Hmm. What next? What's she doing? How's that a dog? I know. I'll draw some small circles. That should be enough. Now I'll draw some semicircles. I'll add a nose and some eyes. I'll draw some of the details. And it needs a tail! There! A cute little doggy! It's possum! <laughs> Get it? How did you do that? That's pretty smart. How's your drawing? Well, uh, art is subjective, remember. If you squint, it sort of looks like a dog. Ooh, that's rough. Let's see who won! Wow! Would you look at that! I'm so happy! Do I win a dog? I'd love a fluffy dog! Ahem. What is it? That's it? It's cute, but I'd prefer a real one. I'll take it. You can have it. The garden is just lovely today. Oh, an apple right from the source. Look at all of these lovely fruits just waiting to be gathered. Hey, do you see what I see? She's so cute! It smells so delicious and sweet. Oh my goodness! I can't believe it! Look at this beautiful arrangement! My goodness, these blooms frame a mirror! Oh wow, look at that! She really loves those flowers! I can't believe it! I'll have to take another look! This can't be me! Can it? Have I grown younger? I was so beautiful back then! Is it a magic mirror, do you think? I don't know. Oh, I just feel completely inspired now. Where's she going? Eh, 
doesn't matter. I better check my mirror. Hmm, where do I want to start? Oh, are you gonna paint me? Okay, hold on one second. I can do something better, I promise. Oh, yes, that's what I want to do. A stroke here, and over here too. Yes! Yes, paint me like one of your French girls, or something. What a wonderful day I'm having. <laughs> yes, you're being the perfect muse, Grandma. Maybe if I try to plump up my skin a bit. <laughs> oh, what is it? What do you want? You're done? Okay. Here you go, Grandma. This is the portrait I did of you. What? Did you not see my reflection in the mirror? Wait a second. You, go away. I need the space. Shoot. Okay, Grandma, stay right there. Hmm, I need to take some measurements here. What? What are you doing? Got it. Now I just need to place my fists on the canvas. Now I just need to trace my knuckles here. Great. Now I just need to add on to the shape. This little swirl can trail down like this. I'll continue the pattern over here, too. I'll add the little bow, too. More little hair swirls down here. Time for the eyes. Two of them, of course. All right, next will be the eyebrows. And I'll start on the nose. I'll add some hearts, too. And now it's time for some color. I'll start with yellow. She's gonna be a pretty blonde, just like that mirror reflection. And I think I'll give her blue eyes to go with that blonde hair. The bow can be red. That'll be pretty. I think her lips can match the bow, too. I'll give her some rosy, youthful cheeks. Can't forget about filling in the hearts. Uh-huh. Done. Hey, Grandma, I'm done with your portrait. Okay, listen to me. Take this portrait over to the grandma and show her. This is what she thinks she looks like. Exchange it for the mirror. All right, so take it over there. Go on, head over. Hello, Grandma. Here's another portrait of you. Oh my goodness, thank you so much. Well, you can have it if I can have your mirror. Give up my mirror? Oh, I don't know about that. Oh, I don't know if it's working. I need that mirror. <sighs> okay, fine. I will make that exchange. Hey, I kept the mirror just like you asked. Yes, thank you so much. <gasps> ah, what the heck? Is this what I look like? Do I really have such a piggy looking nose? Ah! Hello, class. What are you doing? David, quick. Oh no, Ugh, I'm not good under pressure. Uh, it's all yours. That seems strange, but okay. I'll get out of here. That was close. But you did it! Sorry I'm late. Let's begin today's lesson. Huh? Why isn't the chalk writing? <laughs> this is so funny. I don't understand what's happening. Maybe it's dirty. Wait, there's something on the board. Is that soap? Oh, I'm so disappointed, class! <laughs> that was a classic. It's okay, I just need to compose myself. I know, I can use my notebook. I'll put a strip of tape along the edge. I have some chalkboard paint. I'll cover the whole notebook with the paint. This is actually relaxing. It's almost finished! I'll let it dry. Now I can remove the tape. Careful, I don't want to ruin the paint. I don't need a chalkboard. I can use the notebook. I'll just write the problem onto the notebook cover. It works really well. I just need the answer now. Ugh. What's happening? Okay, class. Who wants to answer this? You! But… Fine. Get up here. Just act cool. You're not so smart now. Oh… Okay, I think I know this. How's that? Wrong. Sit down. What are you thinking? Spend less time doing pranks and more time studying. Let me get rid of this. Madison. Me? Oh, this is gonna be bad. I late? This class should be a breeze. <sighs> Math's my jam. What? I didn't know there was a test today. I didn't even study. Think the teacher will notice this? 
she's not looking over here, right? What is Jennifer doing? Young lady? That better not be a textbook! Well, that didn't work. Maybe I can sneak at Kate's test. Way to be sly, Jennifer. Jennifer! I was just stretching, miss! What am I gonna do? Jennifer! I've had enough of your nonsense! Oh, I can't fail this class. Hey, my ring. This was the answer all along. Have some graph paper lying around? Grab some scissors. And cut out a bunch of squares. Staple them together to make a book. Then write in those answers. It's tiny, but legible. Once you've put in the answers, glue the top to your ring. Once it's dry, you're good to go! Oh, I can feel the power! Who knew math could be so easy? And the teacher won't even notice. Be cool, Jennifer! I have my eyes on you, Jennifer. You may need new glasses, then. <laughs> I need something that'll turn some heads. And I know just the thing. Complimentary hues for the win! But it's still missing something. But what? Ugh, this ball is so dinky. Whoa! That thing's blowing my mind! Mom! Oh, not now. Okay. You still have a lot of pain left. Which leaves room for me to play. Thank you! I just don't know what to do. Okay, I'll try a little. Hey! Where did my paint palette go? David? Is that you? Excuse me? Look! I did this! I call it pond water. Uh-huh. Oh, I know. You want to face paint? Give it a try, David. Whoa! Again! Fun, right? You can say that again! Yeah? What if I use my finger, too? Incoming! Ha! Blue dots coming in, people! But now for my favorite color! Woohoo! That's it! Look, mom! Well, isn't this incredible? But let's try one more trick. Symmetry can sure be beautiful! And to prove that to be true, you created it all on your own! It's a gorgeous butterfly! This line will really make it come to life! Along with the outline of the wings! Other side! There! Just admire this pure beauty! And that's just the beginning, son! This is so hard, I don't get it! Nope, that's not right. I need to be quick. This makes it so much easier. Ahem. You won't learn that way, Cheryl. Can I go to the toilet? Go. Be quick. I'm never passing that class. Ooh, I'll have a glass of water. I need a break from classwork. I need to think of a plan. Hold on. I've got it! This is pointless. This is a great idea! I'll write numbers on this cup. And then slip another cup over it. I'll draw the addition and subtraction signs on this cup. I'll repeat this with more cups. I just need to slide the cups to get the correct answer. Yes! I've got it! I would never have gotten that answer. It's so simple now. I'm gonna have to use my toes soon. Uh, maybe I should help Luna. Hey, 
Keep your socks on. Use this. Wow, thanks. Wait. What are you doing? Oh, I tried. I'm so confused. I take my cleaning job pretty seriously. Okay, time to check it. Spotless. Just as I thought. But there's a lot more to do. I need to finish this classwork. Ugh. My pencil's broken. Luckily I have this sharpener. This is quite dusty. Huh? Huh? Chew! What the? Not on my watch! It was an accident, I swear! I've got it, see? Wow, that was intense. Oh, I have an idea. But I need an empty bottle. Okay, let's get creative. I'll start by removing the bottle cap. Then I'll cut a hole in it. Next, I'll flip the cap over. And apply glue around the edge of the hole. That should be enough. I'll stick the sharpener to the bottle cap. Once it's set, I'll screw the cap back onto the bottle. That's just what I need. Now the bottle will collect any debris. There's no more mess. I'm watching you. There's nothing to worry about. It's all in the bottle. Hmm. That boy will go far. Hmm. This is tricky. I really should have studied. Psst. Madison. Madison. Hi. Hi, David. Oh my gosh. This is it! These are for you. You're so romantic! I can't wait to spend the rest of our lives together. I'm so happy! Hey, champ! Oh, he's got my mustache! Coochie goo! Life is perfect! Hey, Yoo-hoo! Are you there? So can I borrow a pen? Oh, right! Uh, of course! Here you go! Wait. I can't give David a chewed up pen! Let me find another one! Wow, I really need to stop eating pens. Hi, David. Hey, Emma. You can have my pen. Just wait a minute, okay? I don't believe this. What's Emma doing? I need to be quick. That looks good. I won't be long. <laughs> I must have a pen somewhere. That's it? Oh, maybe I can use this nail polish. I think this might work! I'll start by taking a pen apart. Then I'll cut off the nib. I'll put some glue on the end of the nib. Now I need the nail polish. I'll place the nib in the bottle and surround it with glue. I'll let it set and then replace the top of the pen. That should do it! It's now a glitter pen! Ooh, that looks fancy! I can put the bottle cap back on! It's better than a boring pen! Here you go! Oh my gosh! We touched! Now I can do my work! This is the best day ever! This is a good pen, thanks! Yes! It worked! You're so pretty! I mean, your writing… your writing is pretty. I'll have to give my ice cream back. Not the rocky road. Yeah! Time to do painting! I'm an artist! I'm the best at art! Painting is fun! Oh no! I got paint on your computer! I know! I'll just clean it off! Wait, it's just smearing! Oh no! It's making an even bigger mess! It all just turned pink! She's gonna be so mad at me! Huh? She's awake! Uh, what are you doing? Why are you staring at me? Huh, you're acting weird. Really suspicious. Wait a second! Ah! My laptop! What happened to it? You painted it pink! Huh? What's this over here? A straw? Wait! I can totally salvage this travesty! 
Okay, here's my poor, messed up laptop. I need more paint. That's right, more, not less paint is the solution. White and yellow too. And some purple. So pretty. And maybe just a bit of this brownish yellow. Okay, now I'm ready for the straw. I'll start blowing this paint now. I'll use the air to push the paint around the laptop. Gotta keep going. I like the different colors for sure. And the patterns and textures it makes are cool! Wow! It turned into a legit piece of artwork! It's beautiful! Makes me think of waves in the ocean! I can't believe how well it turned out! Wow! Look at her computer! So cool! Elle, get some new art! Yikes! No thank you. No! Another rejection! Ah! Stranger! Help! Attack! Calm down. What's up? No one wants to buy my artwork. Grandpa, what are you even doing in that trash can? What do you plan to do with that garbage? You still don't trust me? Well okay then, you'll have to watch. I'm gonna set this lid down on paper. And now to start spray painting the paper. I just want to coat the whole thing. Don't be afraid to cover the lid. And now to add some white paint down here in the corner. Want to just fill this whole space. And then it's plastic bag time. I'll dab the white with this bag. It'll pull the paint up a bit. There we go. And now I'll speckle it with some more white paint. Time to take the lid off. There we go. It's done. Ta-da! Wow, grandpa! It's incredibly beautiful! I can't believe how easy it was for you to make this! Here, you can have this. I want that painting! Take all my money! Yes! We finally get a break! And that only means one thing. I get to chow down on my leftovers. I made the yummiest soup last night. Just one whiff of it and you will fall in love. Ah, <sighs> yeah, that's the stuff. Spoon's in here somewhere. A fork? I can't eat my soup of this thing. I could have sworn I brought a spoon. Anything? I guess no one's eating soup today. At least I have some juice. I'm out of that too? This lunch is turning into a real dud. Hmm. This cup is made of paper, right? And I do have a fork. Need a spoon? Cut the bottom off of a paper cup. Then stab it side with a fork. Keep going through the bottom too. And just like that, we're back in delicious soup city. This stuff is seriously so good! Turns out, I'm a genius in the classroom and in the kitchen. Hey! What do you think of my new jacket? I totally got it on sale! It was 50% off! Isn't it just the best? Yeah, it's nice. I get it. But check out my new jacket! What do you think about my new phone case? Sparkles are so last year. I've got poppets. Whatever. I have this notebook too. I decorated it with stickers. Hearts and stars and one little ice cream treat too. What? Oh, My notebook is so boring and plain. This isn't gonna work at all. There's gotta be something I can do. Hmm? I've got these markers. Wait! I think I've got a plan! I've got markers on this knife. I'll cut off the tip. And then I'll make a few more cuts so it'll look like a heart. Aw! Look how cute it turned out! And now to bring out my notebook. I'll use it like a stamp. I don't have to stop at hearts either. There we go! I've got hearts and stars now too! See? My notebook has that too. And I didn't need stickers. Whoa! I can't believe you made that! Class has never been the same since we all got smartphones. Just ask the teachers. Yep, it's phone box time. I gotta hide this! 
You ladies getting any studying done? Ugh, I'm about to win! I hate it here. Like I want to read about photosynthesis. If you want to use your phone, you've got to be next level sneaky. The answer was here all along! Face your phone face down. And use hot glue to make a line. Keep going all the way down. Then stick a colored pencil to it. Perfect! Now do it with a bunch more. Looks kinda cool, right? Now when I take my selfies, I never give myself away! Just using my colored pencils. What a fool! This hack is totally genius! I'm so excited for art class! Okay, class. Today I want you to draw a cat. Look at his cute face. Begin! Oh, this is tricky. There's his tail. Wow, that's bad. Finished! I was a little rushed, so it's not my best. What? Unbelievable! Mwah. Mwah. This is the worst day. Give me that. Ah, oh, but you're worth it. Hmm. I have an idea. This might work. If I wrap the rubber band around the pen, and I do the same at the other end, I can trace around the cat in my notebook. It's working! As long as I follow the lines, it's a perfect copy. Wow, that looks so good! It's perfect! I'm impressed, Cheryl. Thanks! I'm a natural! A B? Wonderful as always, Luna! A plus! Keep up the good work! Thanks! <laughs> oh no! It's still printing! Shh! Stop! What? Nothing to see here! Oh, I hate art class. Book? This thing can't be that bad. Oh, already bored. Who could that be? Hello? You finished the book yet? Me neither. I'd rather do anything else. Like watch a movie! Oh, here comes the good part! Die, robot, die! Come on! Just two more points! Oh man, what time is it anyway? What? How is it almost eight? This new pen is awesome! Did I make it? Hey! Did I miss a lot? So, I know you're all wondering about the nucleus. I don't know if I can stay awake for this. Uh, Nina? Nina! I said Nina! Wake up! Hello? Hmm. Ugh, this is miserable. I just need to look awake, right? Bright eyes to the rescue! To make a pair, first you'll need a selfie. Well, just the eyes. Do I look awake yet? But if you add sulfur to the mix… Nighty night. Anyone have any questions? Oh boy. We've got a sleeper, folks. Perhaps she needs a little wake-up call. I'm coming over there. Oh no! Oh, Nina. Trying to catch some… Should I? You picked the wrong class to do it in. Hello! Earth to Nina! What? Well, good morning! <laughs> sure glad that wasn't me. You're so dreamy. Hey, Luna. You look good. This is so awkward! It's so annoying! That's it! It's the same every day with you two! Wow, calm down. Hmm. I have an idea. I know how to talk to Kevin without annoying Cheryl. First, I'll cover my notebook with this tape. That should do it. Then I'll cut a square out of the sponge. Just like this. 
Next, I'll apply some glue to the sponge. I don't need too much. And I'll stick the sponge to this pen. Now to write a message for Kevin. There. Hey, pass this to Kevin. This is for you. Take it. Awesome. I better reply. How is this any better? I'm telling teacher! Miss! I'll take that. I better erase the message. I can't wait until tonight. Give me that! Miss! Look at this! Yes, Cheryl? They're passing notes! Look! But it was there! Ah, don't waste my time, Cheryl! There was a note! I saw it! Oh no! My test! I'm gonna fail! No! See you tonight. I can't wait. Take that! Wait, what's that? Oh! It looks so cuddly! There's a tiny draft, too! This one's mine! Aww! Okay, I guess this little guy's mine. Heh, <laughs> my draft is much better. Okay, don't move. I need to draw you. So far, so good. What are you doing? I'm examining the draft. Oh, good idea. Hmm. I wonder how Justin's doing. Pretty realistic, isn't it? I'm gonna call him Jerry. It doesn't look like a draft. This is gonna be tricky. It's all about getting the right scale. Hang on. I have an idea. I'll place my hand like this and then draw around it. I'll add a face. And now it's a draft. Let's color it in! This brown is the perfect color. And I can color the rest yellow. Careful! I don't want to make any mistakes now. Now for the neck. That's it! I'm glad I thought of that. Yeah, okay, that's pretty good. Oh, I'm sorry, Jerry. You can have this! Thank you! Ready for this one? Pink means… An eagle! Not done yet! What? Is this supposed to mean something? Is it a secret code? Let me see something here. Hmm. This is a real thinker. I wonder what I should eat for lunch. Ooh, she sure knows what she's doing. <gasps> My hand hurts! That's it! The dots just anchor the eagle! Now I just have to color it in! It's better if I speed it up. Looking good! And that's all, folks! Done? Ooh, just in time! Check it out! <gasps> I'm very impressed! Aw, shucks. I did mine freestyle! Plus, it's sparkly! Do you love it? It's like a mermaid bird! <laughs> okay. <laughs> What's college without some partying? We can always study tomorrow, right? It's getting pretty late, Betty. Hey, we're getting really tired over here. See you ladies in class tomorrow! I'd better hit the hay, too. Why does my entire body hurt? Yeah! I look like absolute death. I gotta hydrate. Whoa! What's wrong with this thing? Now I'm soaking wet. I'll hydrate later. That feels good. Maybe that's just what I need. Need to look more alive in the morning? A bowl of cold water can do wonders. 
We're talking ice cold people. Make sure the bowl is extra large. Then fill it up with plenty of cold water. Once that's done, pour in a bunch of ice cubes. In you go! Once the water is good and chilled, the magic begins. Ah! Make sure your whole face gets in there. Man, that was refreshing! Goodbye, puffy eyes. And I'm fresh as a daisy. It's a beautiful day, isn't it? I can barely stay awake. Hi! Whoa. I look good, right? My head hurts. Catching up on the latest memes, Lana? Mom's coming to visit? This place is definitely not mom ready. What am I gonna do? Cleaning's the last thing I want to do. Well, no time like the present. Why does my mom care, anyway? It's just some dirty clothes, right? Why can't she get off my back? She'd better appreciate all this. Now, where do I hide all this? I should have some extra room in here. Just gotta open this thing up. It's gonna be a tight squeeze! Phew. Hopefully it'll stay closed. Mom will definitely approve of this. Yep, I'm a cleaning whiz. Move the meeting. I'm visiting my daughter at school. I don't care if you don't like it. Well, that's done. Is Lana's apartment clean? Mm, could be worse. At least there aren't clothes everywhere. When's she coming back anyway? I'll put my scarf in here for now. Avalanche! Oof! Get these dirty things off of me! This better not be underwear. Oh, thank goodness it's not. I can't leave this place like this. I just have to employ my quick folding method. See? Just takes two swift moves. Ta-da! And before you know it, this handy trick will turn your mess into neat folded piles. <sighs> it's looking way better already. Isn't Lana lucky to have such a helpful mom? That girl will never learn. Hey, I think this piece is finished. I don't want to get ahead of myself, but I think this might be a masterpiece. I'll just set it over here on the easel. Wow, I love it! Ooh, bubbles! I think I deserve a bit of a reward! Yes! Look how many there are! I love bubbles! Hey, I'm back. Oops! I knocked that painting off. Oh, it was my masterpiece! The best I've ever done! Wait a second, Bubbles? This gives me a great idea. I've got a plastic bottle. I'm gonna cut off the top. And now I'll stretch a little net over the opening. Next up, I'll pour soap into this glass tray. That should be enough. Now to dip the net end into the soap. Now the soap has stuck to the net. Time to add some paint to it. I'll drip some blue. Some red, too. And then yellow, of course. Primary colors, check. And now it's time to start blowing some bubbles. I'll just make sure I'm close to the canvas. And now I'll pop some of these bigger ones. There we go. I think the work is done. Hey, what do you think about this? Whoa! How did you do that? I just took inspiration from your bubbles. I made it for you. Thank you so much, Grandpa! I love it! Bubbles are truly great! Okay, time for the next challenge! Oh my gosh, a unicorn! I'm so happy! 
Whoa! Dial it back a little. I need to hang out with new people. What are you doing, Chris? <clears throat> I'm Princess Sparkles, ruler of the Rainbow Kingdom. Sure, this is a different look for you. Stop. You're ruining this. Let's spin the wheel. This is so awesome! No hands? No problem. Here goes. I'll put mine behind my back. That's actually a good idea. Hmm, I thought this would be more difficult. Not bad. Finished! What do you think? That's certainly… something. What do you know about art? I'll show you how to draw a unicorn. Let me just check the scale. Oh, yeah, I, I always check the scale. Definitely a unicorn. What's he doing now? Hmm, I think I have a plan. This should make things easier. Start with a sheet of grid paper. And start to draw the unicorn. It may look a bit funny at this stage, but trust us. That looks good. Once the outline is done, start to fill in the middle. This is a really good way of drawing something with a lot of detail. Using grid paper allows you to scale up drawings. And it helps to make drawings easier. Time to add color. If only coloring in was this easy. Let's get some more colors in the horn. I told you we knew what we were doing. There! My own unicorn! Check this out! It's good, right? How did you do that? I mean, mine has colors in its hair. <sighs> At least you tried. I know. <sighs> She's so pretty. Time to see if I can impress her with my talents. I'll start with this blue. But I'll also need other colors, too. Definitely gotta fill this heart with pink, of course. There! She's gotta get the message with this painting. I wonder if she'll like it. You made that for me? Ugh! Get it out of here! Ouch! Nope. I don't want that reaction. Yeah, this is garbage. Wait, what? Oh no! I've got paint all over my hands! This day is not going like I thought it would. Better wash the paint off before I make a mess. Definitely gonna need some soap for this. Wait a second. Wow! Look at this! The suds are colored with the paint! Time to redeem myself! I've got my bowl of water and my dish soap. And of course, I have to add some paint, too. Time to mix this together with a popsicle stick. There we go. It's getting a little sudsy. But I need more bubbles. Time to add some air with a straw. Wow! Look at all of these bubbles! They just keep coming! All right, so long, straw. Now to add the paper onto the bubbles. Just like that. Wow! The bubbles appeared on the paper! Hi! I made you this card. You made this for me? Wow! I love it! It's so beautiful! Oh my gosh! Wanna walk me to class? It totally worked! Painting, you might be my most favorite one of all time! Ah! Grandpa! Watch out! Don't knock over another one of my paintings! Seriously, that could have been a disaster. What if he had actually brushed against it? Oops! Look at that! I got paint all over my suit jacket! Oops! My painting! No! Oh, what a nightmare. I couldn't stand it if that had happened. Oh, I think I've got another great idea. Excuse me, Gramps. I'm gonna need this. Okay, I've got the hairspray. Now to put it to work. I'll just add a layer to my painting. It's gotta be enough to actually coat it all, though. There. Now that it's dry, it's completely protected. Look! No paint came off at all! It's finally safe from grandpa mishaps. Oh! Hey, you're right! It worked! There's nothing on my jacket! Phew! Good thing I thought ahead. My painting is safe and sound. Time for another spin! Look at them go! Orange? It's a surprise round! I don't get it. Pick me! I know! 
a, a fishing pole! Nope. Oh, wait! I got it! <sighs> yes, Brian? A car, right? No, not a car. It's a unicorn! Uh, oh. <gasps> I can draw one of those! I only have a million of them! They're my favorite! See? <laughs> this girl's officially lost it. Cool, right? <laughs> okay then. Start the clock. Unicorns can't be that hard. It's all about a bunch of bright colors. And markers on plastic don't really dry. So when you color them close together… And add a little bit of water… They all kinda melt into each other. Push another piece of paper on top, and it makes a cool tie-dye effect! And whatever you draw on top is sure to look super magical! And you can just color it black! See how it pops against all the different colors? Neat, huh? Is time up already? Mine's done and perfect! You can say that again! I love that! What about your drawing? You have nothing, Madison? Mm, meh. Like I need more of these things. Nope. I don't need one. Okay. Suit yourself. Hmm. I hate seeing her sad. Here. Want my drawing? You can never have too many unicorns! Oh, so sweet! Man, that third mile was rough! <sighs> and that summer heat doesn't help! Oh, man. These dogs are howling! I don't have the energy for this! These laces are just so tight! Oh, I can't undo this stupid knot! Okay, now I'm getting irritated. Gah! Come off! Ah! Come on! This is hopeless. And on this day… Ah, this bath is just what the doctor ordered. Jennifer? Do you want to explain yourself? What are you gonna do? This is offensive, Jennifer. Hey! Why don't you use my bobby pin? This trick gets knots out every time! Take the bobby pin… And stick it through the tight knot. Put the second pin in the opposite way. Then hold both and pull! See? Works like a charm. You know you can take those off now, right? Ah… 